day three. Here, we're still here at Quest Chatswood. We are going to the wildlife to see the kangaroo and other Australian animals. So, kinain namin yung kagabi. Now, we are going to see them. <laughs> Weird. Pero ang sarap. In fairness, ang sarap nung, ano, nung pizza kagabi. Medyo, hindi lang ata ako natunawa. Nakatap ng CR ako today. But, let's see. It's still cold, pero maaraw. Let's just enjoy the day. We're here inside the train. Two floors. Amazing. Luna Park, just beside the Harbour Bridge, but it's closed. Well, no one goes here during Monday, Sabe, so yeah, okay, and I'm not a fan of rides either, so no thanks. Australia, it's important to avail this card so you can use this on the tram stations or tram. You can also use this on train. And here in um, what do you call this? The Milsons Point, where you ride a ferry around the Harbour Bridge in the Upper House, you can also use this one. So the price range for the ferry is around two to three dollars, but it depends on the but it depends how far you go around. But Normally, it ranges from to just eight dollars. So. Since I'm here, I'm going to get there. I'm going to get there. Don't be able to burlesque me there. I'm going to get there. I'm going to get there. So I survived being alone. I'll be meeting my family at a restaurant here in Chatswood. Medyo alam ko naman na kung saan ako dito. 
since madalas kami dito sa train station but yeah anyway so I went to a local we went to a local bathhouse here pero ikukwento ko na lang siguro on a separate vlog yun ang yari because go there but yeah I'm walking towards the restaurant now and it's pretty cold and yeah I'm quite confident here now medyo alam ko na kung nagsan ako it's pretty 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 nice here in Sydney pero very city life Although may mga beaches kami pupuntahan tomorrow. Pero, yeah, I'll probably would want to go back here. Napaka laid back. So, brown chill vibe. And I like the cold weather though. Pero syempre nakakamiss yung init ng araw. Pero, what can you say? It's nice here. Tsaka, wala, ang social <laughs> ang social at saka ano, parang advance ng mga bagay-bagay dito ay nako anyway I'll see you guys later I'm quite hungry now so, bye good morning day 4 here in Sydney so we are going to Bondi Beach tapos afterwards we'll go to Sydney Eye yun lang yung pinaka agenda namin here and then we'll go to Wollongong by tonight stay there for over a night and then go back here cause flight na namin ng Thursday so we have to settle everything by tomorrow anyway I'm here sa, sa balcony medyo tolerable naman yung lamig tsaka may araw hopefully this goes on the whole day and yeah, so far so good here in Australia. So we are now at Bondi Beach. since most of um, the living areas here are um what do you call that? Nasa gilid ng dagat I forgot the term so lahat daw mayroong mga rock pool but ito yung rock pool dito sa Bondi Beach yung rock pool na parang inayos talaga like mukha siyang pool so we're heading towards that but Look at the view. Gorgeous.
Philippines, we are heading to the Sydney Eye Tower observation deck. So we chose the observation deck, but there are two options. You can do the skywalk or you can do the observation deck. That's it for today actually, that's the last stop we have for today, so enjoy la! Freezing, although 18 degrees lang siya. Nawaba English na talaga. <laughs> although 18 degrees lang siya, pero sobrang hangin kasi hindi ko sure kung naririnig niyo ako. But it is. Anyway, yan yung view dito. Saan? Para siyang pagod po. Like froth milk. It's no spots. Ayan. So, yung nandun, yun, yun. So, my coastline. Dinaanan namin kanina yung bridge. Para siya yung sa pagodpod nga. Na mahaba ding bridge along the coastline. So, I'm drinking a cappuccino lactose free. Because lactose intolerant nga ako. Whew. Lamig. Watson's Bay. I'll probably eat here under the fish and chippery over there. Because they wanted us to taste the fish and chips here. Uh, Medyo tolerable yung coldness yeah, The windy. But not like in Wollongong earlier at the Bald Hill. Nice, really, really nice here. Hi, so I yun, balik na kami. We are fixing our stuff already, and tomorrow, 11 20, yung flight namin, so we have to leave here early at around 7 punta na kami na airport anyway ayun sobrang ano ba iba iba yung feeling dito sa loob sa Australia like from small things na tayo sa Pinas sanay tayo lagi nasa right sila dito nasa left yung driver seat yung sa escalator lahat sa left lagi tapos Sobrang advanced dito that you can use your phone or your Apple Watch or mga smart watch. Tapos, meron sila isang part on, I think, an app or whatnot na nakalagay lahat doon. As in, from your visa, from your credit cards to debit cards. Even yung COVID vaccination cards nila nandun. Yung mga Opal cards, yung tinatawag yun, yung ginagamit pang train, pang tram, pang bus, pang ferry. Yan, yung tinatap upan. Yun, you can put it on your phone or on your smartwatches. 
So, yung mga ganun ba, guys, maliliit, pero sobrang would really make a difference kasi it's very efficient. Tapos, anywhere you go, pwede ka mag-top up dun sa Opal card mo and everything. Tapos, meron din sila dito na um, meron din sila para ukay-ukay dito. So, yung mga ibang pasalubong dun namin binila sa Paddy's Market. Yung mga souvenir shop yan, mga ganun. Tapos, ang lamig. Yun lang. Kahit hindi pa winter, sobrang lamig na. Nagda 9 degrees talaga. So far, 9 yung pinakamalamig na na-experience namin. Pero, may mga times na sobrang windy, kaya mas grabe yung lamig. Tapos, iba yung vibes dito. As in, kahit sa train, nakakaaliw yung train nila kasi parang tatlong level. May lower, may parang mezzanine. Tapos, merong second level. So, parang wala. As in, tapos, mga disiplinado yung tao. Tapos, pati pag-cross mo and all. As in, very, very different sa atin. It feels like parang sa so sobrang efficient and advanced nila. Parang ayaw mo na pumalik. Ako personally, parang ayaw ko na pumalik. Although, love ko talaga Pilipinas. Pero after experiencing this, sobrang efficient. As in, wala. Tapos, meron dito sa atin, mafe-feel mo kapag mayaman ka or mahirap ka kasi sobrang laki ng gap na pakiramdam na mayaman at mahirap pati yung mga tirahan. Pero dito, meron dito parang mga housing na pang mayaman as in million yung worth. Pero katabi nila housing na pang middle class or lower class. Pero magkatabi lang sila, pares lang sila ng view, pares lang sila ng hangin na hin na pinibreathe. <laughs> Yun, tapos medyo na-adapt na namin yung ye, yeah, ye. Yeah. <laughs> Kasi yung yes nila. Usually tayo, yeah. Yes, kani sa kanila, yeah, yeah, yeah. So parang kami, yeah, yeah, ganun na din. Pero it was quite a different experience talaga. Well, being a first out of the country experience ko, syempre memorable talaga siya. Pero as in, iba. Parang naglo-look forward tuloy ako to other countries na pwedeng puntahan. Hopefully, mapuntahan ko na yung isa sa mga dream destination ko, which is Japan. Um, baka mag-apply na rin ako ng visa soon enough. But yeah, anyway, um, I hope you like my Australian travel vlog. I know this is different now from the local travels that I have. And sana may mga, sa mga gustong pumunta ng Australia, sana may mga natutunan kayo or nakuha kayo information from this vlog. Um, if you have any further questions, you can email me. I'll put my email on the description box or you can just simply comment on the videos. Um, siguro mga 1, 2, 3 or even 3 part vlog siguro itong gagawin ko. So, ayun. Anyway, um... Do not forget to like and subscribe. Also, click the notification bell so you would be notified on my next vlog. Um, medyo matagal siguro yung travel kung susunod. Siyempre, kailangan ko muna pag-ipunan. But, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the vlog and I'm gonna see you guys soon. Bye!